Hi, friends. Today we are talking Microsoft Word. This is the tool most of us are pretty familiar with, and the doc format has one of the most shared one for document text and the like. While the program is part of the Microsoft package that you can get with Office 2021 or is part of Microsoft 365 subscription, it might not make sense for you to pay for the whole thing if all you need to do is a quick edit in a document once in a blue moon. If you want Word for Mac on your laptop or computer more permanently, your options are to get a Microsoft 365 subscription or buy Office 2021 once. Both have business and family plans, which means you could ask your employer or relatives if they have any extra seats they could allocate to you. If not, you'll have to pay to get MS Word for your Mac permanently. As for free Microsoft Word for Mac, not a lot of people know this, but the web version is actually free to use. Just Google the keywords Microsoft Office on the web and go to the sign up page. If you already have a Microsoft account, just sign in. If not, choose sign up. On the next page, type in your email address, then create password. Here, you have to select your country, add birth date, next, verify your email, you might also get asked to verify if you are not a robot. To create a Word document, just find the MS Word icon on the left side of your panel and click on it. Now you have Word for Mac for free. Alternatively, you can sign up for a Microsoft 365 free trial. It's for one month and you can use everything in the pack within this time frame. To get it, just Google Microsoft 365 free trial and the first search result is usually the one you want. Just check the page address to be at Microsoft.com. That's how you can get free Word for your Mac for one month. And finally, you can try third-party apps that are alternative to Microsoft Word. One of the most popular ones is Google Docs. There's also LibreOffice. For more targeted tasks, we like the selection of text editing apps on SetApp. Collabio Spaces is perfect for teams. It allows your team to sync up documents even offline. If your team is together in the same location but has spotty internet, Collabio Spaces is great. You can edit together and share. For writing longer pieces, Ulysses is the app you want. It's great for long text that have many parts. Ulysses has a markdown editor. You can structure your text easily and even publish. Just your text and no distractions. That's what the app is made for. Speaking of distractions, for a truly stripped down experience, Focused is even more text focused. It will not let you structure your text as well as with Ulysses, but if all you want on your page is text and nothing but your text, Focused is made for the task. Use Zen mode to feel as if you are typing on an actual typewriter. So that concludes our overview. We hope this video gave you a solution to your search. Please like if it did and check out more of our videos for tips and ideas for useful day-to-day -day tools on your Mac and iPhone. Oh, and remember to subscribe to catch our future uploads. Thanks for watching.